Sustainable Development Goal has a set benchmark for us, pushing us toward a more sustainable way of living and working. Goals numbers 12 and 13 specifically emphasize the urgency to address our existing linear model. The linear way we handle our resources is not sustainable in the long run. Among the treasures lies lignin, a vital component that gives plants their rigidity. Lignin is also the most second abundant biopolymer on Earth, a sentence that you might not hear very often. Every year, 50 million tons of lignins are produced from industries, yet 98% of them are burned for energy. Of course, this raises an important question. Can lignin reshape the design of polymer industries, like thermoset, for example? Today's thermosets are, made from, are primarily made from uh, depleting fossil waste uh, resources and also give us the challenge to recycle them. Their intrinsic durability, while advantages in so many applications, also translate into difficulty in waste handling. So here is where my research becomes central, because the other question is, how can we use lignin differently? My research delves into a true potential of lignin, by introducing uh, cleavable functionalities, I'm not only enhancing lignin structure, but also pioneering its use as precursor for recyclable thermosets. By modifying lignin in this manner, I hope to pave the way for new thermoset materials that could be easily recycled or broken down. Let's imagine your car parts, your electronic castings, or other everyday products made from this valorized lignin. Once they have served their purpose, Instead of ending up as waste, we can recycle or return them to nature in a more eco-friendly way. So, in a nutshell, this is about how we redefine our view on waste and resources. Nature has provided us with incredible materials, and with some modification, we can utilize them to align with our sustainable development goals and create more circular and sustainable future. Thank you.